to my channel. So today's video is going to be an empties video and what I've been using up the last few weeks and would I repurchase them or not. So I'm just going to get straight into the video because I don't want this intro for too long. So yeah, I'm going to show you my favourite bits and yeah, what I've used up. Actually very little makeup stuff on this. It's more kind of skincare and hair. So the first two things are the Cocoa Brown Kind Shampoo and Conditioner. I did a blog post on this recently um, of my review on them and I absolutely love these so go check out my blog post I'll actually link it below so that you can give it a quick read but I have repurchased these and I use them all the time the one thing I hate about them is how quick they go so they're only 200 mils but the smell of them and oh I just love them so I have repurchased and I will continue to repurchase the next is also a shampoo and it is a purple shampoo purple shampoo is so good for blondes it's to get out like the yellow tone and to give you like a silver kind of look. I'm not a hairdresser so I don't know. But yeah, I got this in a salon shop. It was quite pricey. It was about nine euro for this little bottle. But um I will actually have to purchase it because it actually is so good for your hair. Um I just haven't got around to buying it again. But it is just called Perfection. It's just top care silver. Um yeah I'll try and find that and link it down below maybe. So I have two micellar waters here that I have used up. So the first one is the Garnier one, everyone knows about this, it is freaking everywhere. I have repurchased it many times, this is like probably my fourth bottle, but I love this and yes I would repurchase it. And the next one is also a micellar water like I said, but it is from Nivea and I'm using this one again at the moment, I just have repurchased another one. And this is cheaper than the Garnier one and they do the exact same thing, so I'm obviously loving this one as well. Um, yeah, it's just the exact same thing basically, just a different brand. So the next skincare product is a toner. Um, this is from Ultra Pure Labator Lab Laboratories. It is just a witch hazel soothing lotion. I use this after I cleanse and then I tone. And this was three euro eighty, and it's almost it, it's almost gone. It is gone. It's gone. And I have repurchased it again because I love it so much. It just makes your skin so tight and closes all your pores, and it just does exactly everything that you wanted to do. So yeah, I'm loving that, and I have repurchased it. Next empty that I have used up is this Neutrogena Visibly Clear um, Cream Wash. What I used to do is I used to use this to wash my face when I'd be in the shower. Um, yeah, I don't think I'd repurchase it because I can't. What I have now for the shower is I have a. It's one with the beads for actually exfoliating your skin. This left your skin nice and soft, but it didn't exfoliate it. It was just basically a cream wash which I don't think I would reverse it did smell so nice I can't remember the price range but it was around probably four or five euro um but I don't think I'd repurchase it and it, yeah it was grand like but I don't think I'd repurchase it. Next is one of my favourite tans which is the Be Bold Tan Liquid. I apply tan every week except I'm quite bare right now. I have no tan on right now but this is only 9.95 like it says and it is the best tan one of the best tans ever um yeah I've this all gone like I said I repurchased it but I'm in kind of trying out new tans at the moment because I'm always using this one so I'm kind of trying out new ones at the moment um but yeah I love this one and I have repurchased it like I said it just lasts so long until it goes patchy because nothing worse than freaking patchy tan on your hand or something so I feel this lasts quite a while until it goes patchy but um yeah there's no fake tan smell and it just is so nice and I love it and I definitely would repurchase in the future. It's just such a good tan. So I have one perfume that is all gone and it is the Alien perfume. I don't know who makes it, I can't pronounce it. But this smells absolutely divine. I have ran through about four of these now. I have another one here for backup which is almost gone as well. And I have another one in my drawer that hasn't even been opened yet. But I am just in love with this. It just gives you such a nice smell that lasts all day long, like literally you spray it a tiny bit and like 10 hours later it'll still be there because I hate perfumes that you have to reapply and reapply this one you do not have to, the smell will be on your clothes it's just the nicest perfume ever last but not least the actual makeup empties so if you've been following me on here for a while or on my snapchat um, you will know that I am obsessed with this foundation it is the L'Oreal Infallible 24 hour these are two empty ones I'm obsessed with this foundation yes I would repurchase yes 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 I would it is like 12 euro and it is the best I have it on my skin right now I have another bottle on my skin it is the best foundation for just a flawless coverage and it just is so 
I just can't, I just love this foundation. Like I would never, I don't think I'll ever go back to another foundation. The L'Oreal one is absolutely fantastic and I absolutely love it and I would have purchased a million times over. Next is the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. I have not used this in so long because it's been empty but I need to purchase it. Definitely I do. Um, I love this concealer. Um, it is such ultra, ultra coverage. I used to, when I had really bad skin a few years ago, I used to use this just as a foundation. Um, it is just amazing on your skin. I definitely need to purchase it. This one is in the shade NC30 but I was a lighter colour a lighter shade but this is the best one I think it's around 30 euro or 20 euro it is quite pricey but it's definitely worth it um, the only thing I hate about this foundation this concealer is see how there's some left in the tube yeah I can't get it out but that's the worst thing about it and last but not least I have another concealer which is the Maybelline or the Maybelline Instant Anti-Age Eraser Eye um, this is just the sponge applicator I use it for underneath my eyes um, yeah, this is so good. Again, it is really reasonably priced and it lasts a while, but as you can see, it's gone so. But what I like about it is it actually gets it down to the bottom, there's none left. As you can see. Yeah, but I do love this concealer and I will repurchase it when I get into boots or something. But it's so good and I love how it's sponge applicator. So that is it for my empties. Um, and that's it for this week's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's just something short and sweet. Do add me on Snapchat and my blog and everything. I will link it all down below. So please do go check all them out. And I shall talk to you all next week. Bye bye.